Hi guys, good morning, CJ here. So, um, there's a new update for Huawei, which is this one. So it's a software update. It's 10, 11.0.0.166. And um, let's look at the details on what this will do. Um, it says here that this will be an update and introduces EMUI 11, providing a rich array of possibilities for you to stay connected in all scenarios. This will, this new system version carries forward Huawei's all scenario design concept and provides a richer and more integrated cross device experience. Based on the idea of technology per, for people, EMUI um, 11 brings a more artistic interface design, friendlier in interactions, and more innovative and convenient cross-device connection. Experience for people to perform better work in life. So... For ang updates niya is for multi-window, seamless connection, seamless connection, oops, ba't nagkakaganito? For multi-screen, notepad and gallery, lasting smoothness, ano to? Ha, da, 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 da. Tapos, privacy and security. Ayun. So, this update will not erase your personal data, but we recommend that you back up any important data before updating. Some third-party apps that are not compatible with EMUI 11 may function incorrectly after the update. It is recommended that you update these apps to their latest version in App Store. Which is usual, kahit um, Apple, pag ganyan, nagkaroon ng updates, um, nagkakaroon talaga ng versions dun sa iba. Home screen layout will be rearranged lightly. So, yun lang. napaka konti lang yung updates niya. Um, anyways, let's do it now. So, let's download and install. I am not sure how long will this take, pero mukhang mabilis naman siya. And then, afterwards, I'll check kung meron mang nabago. So, sabi dito, multitask sa window. So, nagkaroon na din siya ng floating window for multitasking. Uh, smoother animation. Well, kailangan talaga nilang ayusin yung animation kasi lately nagkakaroon ng lag itong uh, MatePad Pro. Subtle effects, weather point, Seamless connection, multi-screen collaboration. Huawei phone screen, tablet. Lasting smoothness. Ayun, tapos privacy and security. Photo sharing, privacy. To be for sharing. The package will be deleted automatically after this is completed. Okay, so this update is 1.75 uh, gigabyte. So, di ba si Huawei Mate Pad Pro is malaki naman yung storage niya. So, I think um, the storage that I have on this device is enough to do this upgrade. And so surprisingly, ang bilis nung download ng software. So, it's already 78%, 79%. So, kunti na lang. Um, afterwards, I'll check kung ano yung nagbago. Kung ito lang nga ba yung nagbago or meron pang iba. Pero definitely, they need to update the EMUI. Kasi yun nga, nagkakaroon na ng lag tong screen. So, as Hindi ko alam kung napapansin nyo, pero minsan pag sinaswipe ko siya, nagkakaroon siya ng lag. So, siguro meron na din mga nag-complaints or 
meron nag feedback sa Huawei that that is happening to them that's why they've created na this um, upgrade so let's click on install now and then the device will restart hello hello Tingnan natin kung magkakaroon siya ng effect dun sa aking Google Play Store. Since as you know, I have Google Play Store installed on my Huawei MatePad Pro. And it was uh, a side download. Kasi alam naman natin na si Huawei um, and si Google, they're not friends. So, they, Huawei, uh, Google doesn't really allow Huawei to um, have Google Play Store installed on their device. Okay, so yan na. Um, it's already installing the update. So, hintay na lang din natin siya. Kayo, on your end, um, do you regularly update your EMUI or any softwares that you have on your device? Let me know in the comment section below if you also do that. Kasi ako, as much as possible, if there's an update for the software or um, the applications that I have, I do update it, except for Netflix. Kasi yung Netflix nito ni um, Huawei MatePad Pro, um, sinayd, uh, APK download siya. So, pag mga APKs hin na hindi ko din download sa, uh, pag mga applications na hindi ko din download using um, Google Play Store, you won't be able to um, update it. Also, if you've seen um, my other video, ay, hindi ako sure kung mauuna ko tong ilalabas o yun ang una kong ilalabas. Um, I've created a video for um, what's that? Dun sa may mga virus na dumarating on Google Chrome. Ayaw din niyang um, ma-install using Google Play Store. So, what I did is I, I downloaded an APK instead. Ayun. So, merong mga applications na hindi siya, kahit meron kang Google Play Store installed on your device, um, hindi mo siya basta-basta madadownload sa Google Play Store. Reason being is that si Google, uh, frequent na yung mga updates na ginagawa niya for their application. So, syempre, ginagawa niya ng mga guardrails, yung end security, yung mga applications na meron sila. So, paunti ng paunti, um, merong mga applications na hindi na nadadownload using the Google Play Store. However, there are still ways where you can do it, um, which is, um, like for example, if it's a browser, you can in, instead of downloading it, you can just have a a bookmark for that particular browser, or um, you can also download the application using an APK. So, ano ba yung famous na site na ginagamit ko if I download applications on APK? Uh, that is up to down. Um, if you seen um, my other videos, yun yung kadalasan na site na pinupuntahan ko if I need to download an APK. Ayun. So, successful na daw siya and then it will restart again. At saka, meron din ba kayong screen protector sa, ano, sa Huawei device nyo? Ako kasi tinanggal ko siya. Tinanggal ko yung screen protector ko. Okay, so I need to put on my pin. Ito na siya. So, sabi dito, ser service experience. Ha, ha, ha. Ano to? Ba't ayaw? Hello? Sige, let's join that. Kung ano man yan. Petal search widget. Ah, okay. So, meron ng mga petal search or meron ng widget na ganito which same doon sa Apple. Meron na din mga ganyan na widgets. So, let's um, add tayo. Oh, no! Saan ko ilalagay yung widget dito? 
Ala. Oops, ano to? Ala. Nangyayari. O, oh, no, ba't ganun? Kita nyo ba yun? Parang wala yung nangyayari sa aking... Kita nyo ba yun? Hindi siya nagre-respond. Oh no. Oh no. Nagkaroon na yata ng problema. <laughs> oh my God. Okay. So, kailangan ko na tong i-restart, I think, kasi hindi siya nagre-respond. Ayan, ano, nakikita nyo, hindi siya nagre-respond. After the update, my Huawei MatePad Pro is not responding. Oh my God. What happened? Nakiklik naman yung mga nandito niya, pero the screen... Mm -mm -mm. Oh my god. Ano to? Okay, so I need to, to finish the video na and I think something bad happened to my device. Ayun. So I need to fix that first. Anyway guys, thank you for watching. Um, let me know in the comment section below if you've updated your EMUI to 11 as well and if you're also having the same issues that I'm having. Um, also, please like the video. Give the video a thumbs up if you like it. And subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. And also, if you're interested with videos like this one, especially if you're using Huawei, please do hit the bell button so you get notified every time we, got new, we have new uploads. And as usual, may have a great day. Bye! Subscribe to my channel. Kalimutan ko. Bye!